All right, guys, welcome back to Banisher's Ghosts of New Eden. We are in the middle of a hauntings quest. We are investigating this case of Caleb Watson. His, was it wife and his brother, who was apparently a drunkard, uh, died in a fire. We've just been to the cemetery and apparently he tried to resurrect one of them. I'm pretty certain it was the wife, but because there was no other body for the soul to manifest in and take over the soul or souls um, possessed him. So now he has multiple souls in his one body. That's why he was talking so funny. <laughs> um, before we do this though, I quickly want to go into my settlement thingy. What's it called? The This. And I want to upgrade my gear a little bit because I feel I'm still running around with a green, with a green sword, which could be way better. Uh, this. Here. I would love to get this one as well, but I need an elite gem. Well, at least it's at least it's now blue. I'm blue. New equipment. Ooh, I got better or new stuff. Oh, what's this? Oh, 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 oh! Punch attack damage is increased by five, and this one outburst area of effect sizes. Oh yes, this one please. And I can upgrade as well. No, I don't have enough ghastly concretion. Okay, how many do I have here? One, and I don't know where to put it. Okay. Okay. Was it, was it, was it, was it not? Yeah, it's this one, right? Shite off. <laughs> no. We've been to God's Acre. Quite a tale it told us. You're not Caleb, are you? Or at least not entirely. Ah, can't fog you. Alexander Watson. Long tale short, Caleb tried to bring his dead wife back. And I live here now. So many questions. Where to even start? How did it happen? Do you share Caleb's body? Do both of you share Caleb's body? Share? <laughs> no. This house of flesh is mine. You. But because I am a generous man, I allow my brother to live in the cellar. We were twins. I was the rotten half, they said. But who's the rotten half now? How did it happen? He was trying to bring his wife back. How did you end up in the mix? Caleb made a fine cobbler, a poor brother, a worse husband, and a truly terrible witch. The ritual went to shite because of course he did. <laughs> There's <laughs> something else you should know. <laughs> if you don't know it already. I'm not alone. I completed the ritual. My darling Ruth is in here too. Does Caleb deserve this? Caleb was no saint, but this is hellish grim. Does he deserve it? Aye, he does. And it's not like I killed him. He's alive in here somewhere. Watching me ruin his name. He can hear me now. Destroying his reputation. As I had to hear him destroy mine when he painted me a fornicator. How oh, nice. He took our love. Ruth and mine and killed it. Now our love's reborn and he can do naught but sit and watch. Caleb was a cat. Shite on him. Let him suffer. You died trying to save Ruth from a burning house. True. True. Where was Caleb? And where was Caleb while all this was happening? He was there. He stood rooted in place, frozen in fear. And then it was too late. He could do nothing but watch us burn. Caleb's name was ruined then. 
We're just putting the boot in. Burning to death is like one of the worst ways to go, I, I believe. <laughs> What's the word around here? <laughs> no. Okay, why keep Ruth here? You used the ritual to bring Ruth's spirit into Caleb's body. Why? Love moves a soul to strange endeavors. We deserve a better life. I set myself to claiming it. But what of Ruth's desire? I understand your anger, more so your desire. But what of Ruth's? Did you consider what she wanted? Caleb stole a life from me, but he also stole Ruth's voice. She shrank beneath him. Of course she wanted a second chance at life. I'd like to hear this from Ruth. May I please speak with her? No! We've carved ourselves out a little happiness at last. I'll not have you break it. Please, leave us alone. Give us this. We need to speak to her, one way or another. If he won't tell us anything, perhaps the house Ruth died in will. Okay. I'll be leaving you alone for now. Alone? <laughs> Not really. Mm, never alone. Hush now. All is well. Nothing bad will ever come to us again. Find the burned down house. Ruth and Alexander are having an affair in her husband's body. It's plain wrong. I'll not judge. It's plain wrong. <laughs> I can't find an angle on that. It's just plain wrong. <laughs> Something feels wrong. Something about Ruth. It's kind of funny if though. If we find the ghost tie, we can talk to her. <laughs> He's having an affair with his brother's wife in his brother's body. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> okay, finding the burned the burned house. Ah, hello, sir. Okay, I just I wanted to look if I can find Huh. If I can find the burned house, but I doubt I'll find that here <laughs> in this house. Hugh Bachelor's Hugh Bachelor. We had a bachelor guy in the Dark Forest settlement, right? Diary page one. I think our move to New Eden was a good thing. In Boston, Marcy was not appreciated. She was even rejected. These people don't understand anything. Here, a new life awaits us, and the people of this small town seem more godly than our former neighbors. I'm sure that Marcy will be list listened to. Hmm. Oh, no, it was not. No, Bachelor was not in New Eden. Wait, that was. It was the neighbor of. Charles's wife, right? Our first months in New Eden went well. Marcy integrated rather well. People speak to her, and even if they are sometimes a little confused by her words, they do not judge her, and they seem to believe her when she speaks about her visions. That's because these people are true Puritans, true subjects to God. Today, Marcy refused to go out, and she hardly spoke to me, locked in her thoughts. I think our Lord is communicating with her. Sometimes she reminds me of our mother. Even if she did not have divine visions, the same brightness shone in her eyes, the same brightness of holiness. Sometimes I'm a little disappointed that I did not inherit our mother's wisdom. But in the end, it's better this way. I may not be the God's direct inter interlocutor, <laughs> but I'm the protector of his mouthpiece. Father and mother would be proud to see us. Marcy discusses with our companions and my reputation grows day by day. I'm becoming a respectable man in our community. I miss our parents sometimes and I wish they hadn't left so young. I wish I hadn't had to take care of Marcy when I was old enough to get married. But that was my destiny and today I understand it. Because today, Marcy and I form a divine duo. The word of God and its interpreter. And when we die, we will, at the, we will be at the right hand of our Lord proud of what we have accomplished during our time on earth okay this is not what i was supposed to do i'm looking for a burnt down house sorry sir that i was interrupting your you 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 oh okay locked gotcha this is locked from the other side hello from the other side 
Maybe this? No, it doesn't look burned. Maybe they just started to rebuild on top of it? Ah, oh, no, this is a... Ah. Is it down there, maybe, somewhere? It's kind of blocked. Blockage. Hmm. Wards. I'm going to need a hand here. Yeah, but, 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 the ghost wards feel far away from here. Just one keeps me from manifesting. Fancy knocking it down? Uh, if I can find it, that is. This one? I'm not allowed to shoot it. Is that the one? Oh, this one? I'm not allowed to sh I'm so confused. <laughs> I'm so confused. I'm not allowed to shoot it. Arch that burned down. The roof fell in with them in sight. There's a lot of debris. Debris? Sounding a lot like Debra. Quinky dink. Oh, I don't think so. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Destroy those ghost wards if you want me back. Ma'am, I, I cannot. I'm not allowed. Just not allowed. <gasps> It doesn't let me shoot them! And I can't get close to it! Find a way into the house. I don't understand this shit. I have to go down this way to get there, I think. But for that, I need to go through this house. I don't understand. Can Ghost you... wards. I cannot manifest. Okay, can you tell me? <laughs> I don't understand what the problem is. I, like none of them. I, I cannot shoot them. It do, it doesn't let me. It's it's literally crossed through. There's another path in that small white house you missed. In here. Okay. Wards, you're on your own. Yes, I heard you. Now this one I can shoot? The ward's power is gone. Okay. Off we go then. Bye, debris. So a ladder inside the house, any use? No, I don't know. They usually, when you can do anything with something, then usually you see these dots, even from far away. So if you could interact with uh, a ladder, then the option would have been there. And it would have been highlighted like that. Can I go through here? Or is he gonna be like, nope. Okay, back, back we go. I figured. <laughs> yeah, the, f the town folk here won't be suspicious of that at all. Loud shooting noises. What the? Oh was a different one. Can I just move forward straight? No? Okay, never mind. Maybe I can shoot through a gap in here. Uh, no. No. Uh-huh. Yeah. 
Uh-huh. Progress has been made. Roof's burn journal. Caleb and I had another discussion this morning. I went walking and caught him sobbing in the garden when I came back. He apologized and I took the, that badly too. He's kind and romantic and listens well, which is why I married him, but I'm sometimes uncomfortable. He is my husband and I am his wife, a woman to be loved and not an icon to be worshipped. Okay. Please don't... Please don't crush under... Oh, okay, I thought I'm gonna jump down, but nope. Time must be nearby. That's my way out again, I guess. Incomplete book of birds. A beautiful homemade illustrated compendium of birds of New Eden. Complete with feathers found to match the drawings. Complete? Not quite. Two pages are missing. Feathers, bone breaker, crow, and herring gull. This work shows real sensitivity. Caleb? Maybe. Not Alexander. I suspect we've just learnt a little about Ruth. A heart. A withered human heart. It once belonged to Ruth Watson. How do we know this tie is doused? So who, who the hell cut out this lady's heart? The heck? Ruth of Watson's course. Heart. Ruth's heart binds them like a bushel of rotting corn. But, but... Leave the burned down house. Okay, I'm leaving. I'm out of here. What do you have there? Stop right there, you rank ramp. Criminal scum. Whatever you found, it ain't yours. You buried Ruth's heart in the ashes of the house that killed her. I find that odd. You, a ghost, went digging in the ashes of a dead woman's house. You're ill-positioned to call me odd. Don't think I haven't felt your presence before. Stow your tongue while I speak with Ruth. Ruth, can you hear me? Can you speak? Puck off and die! I'm in charge here! No! Hush ye, Alexander. I'll speak. I'm Ruth. I hear you. I'm Antea Duarte. We're here to help. Oh, I'm glad. Please, end this nightmare. Help me. Go to hell in a bag of shite. We're fine. And you have not the right, you hear? You've not the right. Let me check out his... This here. Oh, this looks creepy. Um, Alexander Watson died trying to save sis his sister-in-law Ruth from burning down. The ghost of Alexander Watson is possessing Caleb's body, body to finally live his love affair with his sister-in-law Ruth. Ruth Watson wants to be free of Caleb and Alexander. The ghost of Alexander Watson is holding Ruth hostage, hostage inside Caleb's body. Alexander and Alexander. To win her for himself, Caleb Watson turned Ruth against his brother. Brother Caleb and Alexander Watson resented each other. Caleb Watson tried to bring wife Ruth back to life, but ended up possessed. Cobbler Caleb Watson tried to possess the woman he loved, only to end up possessed by the brother he hated. Okay. I just wanted to get all the info there. Make manifest, I guess? Her heart! Give it back! Bonk, bonk. <laughs> Present yourself. I compel it. No more does he silence me. We may speak. Where's the voice coming from, though? <laughs> Help me. Please. How? What's the word around here? <laughs> About Caleb's letter. Caleb's letter changed your life. How did it feel at the time? Tore me in two. I loved Alexander. 
but I deserve to marry a man who would be true. Caleb seemed decent. I, I believed he loved me. I thought I'd married the better brother, but I'd married a liar. A liar and a devil. And yet, not even he deserves this. No one deserves this. How did Caleb treat you? When did you uncover the lie? How did he treat you? How did Caleb treat you? With adoration. I was an idol. Worshipped, yet unloved. He was the sculptor and I was the statue. Smiling down, unmoving from my pedestal with nothing to say. Now I'm sewn into a festering sack with the quivering remnants of my husband and the angry ghost of his dead brother. Please, let me out. Who taught Caleb the resurrection ritual? To say it was taught would mean he'd learned it. He read it off a page. As a sorcerer, Caleb makes a fine cobbler. Think about Caleb. He was a good listener. As he worked, clients would bend his ear. The Haskell boy, for one. As Caleb pinned the governor's shoes, young Lammy would talk magic. N nonsense, really. But Caleb was listening. Mm hmm Lammy Haskell. It's always the quiet ones. Wait. Wait, Lammy Haskell gave Caleb the resurrection ritual. After Lammy mentioned the ritual, Caleb became obsessed with it. He begged. Lammy, in his misplaced generosity, gave it. Caleb was intent on dark work. Lammy furnished written instructions. Ruth, your husband Caleb's botched resurrection ritual brought you back, but allowed his brother Alexander to take you hostage. Once we deal with the Watson brothers, you shall be free to ascend. Do what you must. I'll suffer it if it leaves me free to go. No! We can stay. Please, Ruth, let us stay. Look at you. Your counterfeit, a sham of a thing. Your so-called life is no life at all. Caleb lied and stole your love. But when the time was right, you lied and stole his body. We're ending this nonsense now. Yes. Okay, ascend Alexander, banish Alexander, blame Caleb. I feel like, I feel like he needs, he needs banishing. <laughs> I don't know if I want to blame Caleb. Maybe if he would have set the house on fire, then I would have probably blamed Caleb, but um, definitely not Ascend. I think I'm going to banish Alexander. Get out of here. Get out of here. Alexander, yours is no romantic fable. There is no moral to this tale. You're a hostage taker. Nothing more. No, Caleb yes. can go to hell, for he well deserves it. But Ruth and I are in love. Greedy men fight over a woman as if she were a thing. I'm done with that old story. Time to tell a better tale. Ruth is free to go. I shall have my rest now. Thank you. Be gone! It's just Caleb left now. Are they gone? Am I speaking with the cobbler, Caleb Watson? That you, Caleb? I, I, I think... Uh, yes, that's me. Or it, it was me, once. For my bastard brother was my hollow keeper. You're not entirely innocent, though. If you'll permit the unfortunate expression, there was more than one of you in it. <laughs> My brother deserved damnation, and you gave it to him. 
I am an imperfect man. But, uh, but if you're considering the same for me, I'll not go without a fight. I too am an imperfect man. I have mercy and patience in limited supply. Let's not test those limits further, eh? Be nice and go wash, you stink. <laughs> Level 16, look at us. So how do I get out of here now? This way. Alexander loved Ruth like a man loves his hat. Love a woman like a thing and you do not love her at all. Ruth deserved better in life and in death. Yes. That was something. Don't take it to heart. Their choices are not your business. Our choices are my business. Yes. And the consequences too. Don't waver. We could win a battle, but we can't win the war. Nobody should conquer death. And we don't want to pay the price of trying. Someone inside's hard at work. Wait. Spectral stains. Haunted house. Saints and sinners. But I want to do a bit more with the with the governor. I want to tell him that I've done this this quest now. That's what he set me out to do, right? Get rid of the witch. Is this his house? There he is. I'm gonna take your shinies, though. Hehe. <laughs> okay. Governor. May I help you, Mr. McCraith? I have to admit, this is an unusual case. Yes, yes, but have you solved it? Yes. I believe so. But the culprit was not responsible for the plague. At least not directly. Have you found the witch or have you not? Someone here has been dabbling in some dark magic. I have the name. So? What are you waiting for? Do you want to hear the name? Don't you want to hear the name? I do not need to. The principle is what matters. Not exactly. The name is... Lamentation Haskell. No, it can't be. My son is studious. Curious, too curious at times, perhaps. But he does not have a bad bone in his heart. He showed Caleb Watts in a ritual. The cobbler used it and became possessed. Even if true, it would only mean my son was exposed to corruption. It happened before. Bring me proof, banisher. Find the real source of evil. Since when has the governor required proof? I'll yeah. get it. Because it's his son, Not that's me. why. I must find your son, Governor. Sooner rather than later. His interests take him hither and thither. If he isn't here, he must be working on the outskirts. He's been sprucing up one of the abandoned houses there. I ordered them emptied when the sickness hit. Here, yeah. take the gate key. Go there. See for yourself. You're wrong about him. You're wrong about my son. Needless to say that I count, of course, on your discretion. Gate key. Honestly, what I thought I was doing is I would be blaming Alexander Watson. He was quick to condemn till it was his own son on the block. Who's he really protecting? We'll bring him the Himself. proof he wants. If the boy is guilty, his father may not be able to protect him. I didn't even intend to blame Lemmy. I wanted to blame Alexander Watson. <laughs> but it wasn't that easy. Okay, let's go. Investigate the abandoned house. I'm running. <laughs> Into boxes, I'm running. <laughs> yeah, yeah, Lemmy gave Caleb the ritual, but I thought he wanted to know who did the ritual, you know? Up here? Hmm? 
the force. Um. And down here. Oy, oy, oy. Hell's balls. What happened here? Something's emanating from under there. No wonder this place is off limits. Sounds creepy as hell. I was wondering what could tear the uh, the ground open like that. Apart from continental plates moving or something. <laughs> oh, oh. Combat. Combat. Oh, was oh, it chunky guy? Unlock me. Take a potion, take Call a potion. Me. Okay, okay, I'm calling, I'm calling. Oh, oh, call and tear. Must I do everything? You're always begging me to call you. Just make up your mind already. She's like, if you if you don't summon her, let me fight. Call me. And then I call her, and she's like, Nah, do I have to do everything? One of these must be Lammy's hideaway. Wards, I'm going to need a hand here. I thought you had to do everything. Sorry, not this time. Yeah. Guess we have to remove the wards so we can then remove the. Shite. Okay, we have to go back <laughs> um, so we can remove the vines. Wait, where? How can I reach this thing? From here? Wasn't it up there? I'm so confused. It looked like it was... How am I supposed to shoot the ward if I can't reach it? It looked like I could reach it from here, but... Uh, eh. it, it should be there, but how do I get there? <laughs> Oof! For the heart, I'll destroy the roots. So, what think you can fend for yourself? Uh, yes, the only thing I need to do is destroy this thing here, but I can't reach it. <laughs> Because this is in the way. How do I get there? From up there? How do I get around then? Can't go up this way. What is this shite? <laughs> it feels like the way to remove this... Like, it looks like I'm in the wrong order. How, do I have to run all the way around? Is this, is this it? Is there a path here? Uh... Yeah, no. Okay, never mind. I thought I had it, but no. Alrighty then. Bye, mate. You here? Maybe I'm just not supposed to go in that bloody house there. This <laughs> is like. You can go everywhere but there. <laughs> a set of tools, including a scalpel, knife, magnifying glass, and other objects. 
Okay. A book on herbalism. Witch! <laughs> Lemmy's a witch! Okay, wait, let me... I'm not allowed. Okay, we investigate. Key to Lamentation's chest. To his heart. It's the key to his heart. The incisions are clean. The precision of an expert. There's magic here. Though faint. Uh-oh. A map of the other area? Okay. Maybe the path that I need to go to find him? Etienne Roulet's letter. My dearest Lemmy, it has been, as always, a great satisfaction to talk with you again. I love your enthusiasm and wit. You remind me of me when I was your age, so eager to know more about the greatest mysteries of our world, of all worlds. I only wished I could have stayed longer, but I must go back to Providence. Until then, here are some quick notes I throw at you to quench your thirst, some of the meager research my humble self has been able to gather with time and patience. I believe it is fair to admit we know nearly nothing concerning the dreadful Aralu, only the rarest writing dare to talk about. Is it the mythicalist, mythicized, mythicized? <laughs> Hell only the boldest dare to travel to and come back alive? Are all these almost forgotten tales fragments of an unveiled or lost truth? I truly cannot say, but I know this, my dear Lammy. You and me are like Orpheus, ready to cross the forbidden waters and bring back the only fiancé we really cherish, knowledge. Ah, to map those uncharted lands, to pass the threshold and bravely walk those forbidden deserts and... Uh, to map those uncharted lands, to pass the threshold and bravely walk those forbidden deserts and icy rivers only the maddest poets sang about. See what stands beyond and come back to dream some more about it. What a thrill, my young friend, what a goal. If only I was younger, just like you, I would follow you in this untold journey. For now, I can only advise you to be careful. Yes, the threshold between our world and the other side is thinner in New Eden. That does not mean it will be easier to travel there. According to some of my research, some already tried in this area. Petty warlocks and puny witches. Maybe it is why the threshold is so thin. Maybe it is why the dead seem to be so easy al easily allowed to walk this land. Who can say for sure? Last week, while I was investigating on my own, I have clearly noticed some very peculiar vibrations coming from an ancient mill located above a cliff by the seaside. Quite a creepy place, if you ask me. If you were to investigate further into the possibility to find a threshold to the mythical Aralu before we meet again, this could be the place to start. But be sure to be prepared, my dear boy. Boy. My old heart could not bear to lose another promising and beloved colleague. Until we meet again, I can but advise you to keep all this secret. As blessed and gentle as they are, too many of your local friends would not welcome the kind of knowledge you and me both share so cheer cheerfully. Yours as always, Etienne. Aralu, mean anything to you? Not a thing. He mentioned an old mill. Seemed fascinated by the place. I don't like how it's just killing animals the entire time. Nothing incriminating. Let me know. Yet. Remember what we found at. Shit, sorry. I didn't expect them to talk. This place is even more fascinating than I imagined. So many unanswered questions waiting to be answered. Monsieur Roulet was right. I'm sure the tragic history of the old mill has much to do with it. I shall go there. I shall do my work there, unmolested by m suspicious and unscientific neighbors. There's so much to do. So much to do, so much Caleb to see. Watsons. Maybe we're not looking in the right place. If I had something to hide, I might hide it in an abandoned mill. Corvus Corex or common raven, omnivorous and opportunistic by place and season. Carrion, insects, food, waste, grain, berries, fruit, eggs, and small animals. Omnivorous, yeah, they eat everything, pretty much. Um, the dead animals isn't incriminating. I think back in the day it wasn't really incriminating. Why can I not shoot this? Makes no sense. Find your way to the windmill. Uh, this direction. Um, oh yeah, 
yeah, big gap. Big gap in the in the earth. Oh lord. Do I have the hiccups? Oof. This way. Sometimes I'm not too certain about this marker there. <laughs> much curiosity couldn't be danger dangerous yeah could be definitely dangerous for the animals he tries to cut open <laughs> then again if no human on this earth would have ever cut another dead human open then we would have very little knowledge about medicine for example Oh no. I have another insight. No, 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 no. Okay. Shoot, 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 shoot. Wait a minute. He, the big chunky guy, possessed as a lady? I'm I'm a, I'm a confused. Oh, ow! That was a roundhouse. There's a tough one. Watch out! We made it angry. Oh yeah, we did. I'm here. Oh. Bonk, 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 bonk. Touch, 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 touch. Bonk, bonk, bonk. Would you just die? I mean, my God. No. You shall not! They brought more flesh. Watch out! Spectre possession! Where are you going, huh? No, 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 what? No, 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 no! Stop it with this bloody flesh thingy. Flesh suit. Make a run for it! This is fine. I'm still here! Okay, then do something. Okay. Why a mill? Away from the village. Perfect for his research. Perfect to hide secrets. He's not out here for pleasure, that's for sure. Boom! Oh, I found another one of these things. Oh, linen and the farmer statue. Old mill is this way, it says. Or not? Oh, wait, no. And pastures this way, okay. It looked a bit like it was pointing in the other way, but it was pointing both ways, basically. The plank that I was looking at. Spectres are the worst. I think the purple ones are the worst because you can't shoot them. They're dodging, they're so, so dodgy, but once when you use the ensnare ability, it's actually not that bad. Can just stick them to the ground and then, <laughs> you know. Yeah, and I love the rifle Peaceful. exactly. Like home on a good day. Not as hilly, mate. He felt like playing with the lambs. Blair preferred to feed them. And I was too busy dreaming. And you? Oh, I cooked them for dinner. The lambs, I mean. Oh, the girls are furious. Yes, but they weren't hungry. Oh, it's red. Red meant something. What did red mean? Don't just stand there. Move! I am not just standing there. I look at you. Her, her critique sometimes is so un... Ugh. Not fair, woman. Not fair. Ah, oh, it's a never-ending nest, yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, you can probably just farm a few XP, right? If you wanted to. I see shiny stuff in here. I want to go get it. Red, I, the shiny I can't stuff. manifest anymore. Not right now. I'm looting. Ah! 
There's a tough one. Hang on, let me take out the green one first. Go away, big boy! Oh, oh, that's a lot. Oh, 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 oh. Try this on your side. Oh my god. Not now. Okay. Wait, is it two two big ones? No, it's one purple one, right? Shit, I'm stuck. Oh, here we go again. Mama. Did you heal back? Oh, 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 oh. I just want to get rid of the big boy. Oh, shit. Dodge, dodge, roll, 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 roll. Keep rolling, rolling. Heal, heal. Oh, come on, die. Of course. Make a run for it! No! Don't tell me how to live my life! Who are you, death? Your bloody scythe? Go to freaking hell! Where you belong! Okay, we did it. Now, where was I? This way. Oh, there was more specter dust. I don't know how to use it or what it's good for, but I'm keep picking it up. My inventory is unlimited. <laughs> so everything goes into my pockets. This way? Okay. I'm running. Choppy chops. Oh, the choppy chops is real. Hi everyone, welcome in. Harris Hills. I can't help you. Oh! Possession incoming. No! 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 Put you! That was more of. I'm protecting the meat shield. <laughs> Call on me. No. What should we expect up there? A gateway to the mythical Aranu. Whatever that is. Otherwise, terrible tragedy. Dark doings. Sick secrets. At a wild guess. The usual. The usual. These green ones, I think they're called Tormented. They are creeping me out. They remind me of these things that you can see in Silent Hill, the movie. With no arms and just legs and a and a and a head, but everything is covered in skin, and they have these this hole where they spit tar out of, or what it is, through their chest. It's disgusting. <laughs> but they look and move a lot like those. <gasps> Sounds like there's bees or something at first, but it's just wisps, I guess. This isn't over yet. Oh. Oh. Okay, first let's get the tormented guy. Careful! Yeah. Oh, 
Come on. Not the dog. Does so much damage. It's a bit it's a bit of a shame that you you let them free when you hit them, when you ensnare them and then you hit them, you let them free again. That's a bit of a shame. I think it would be very cooler if, if you could just punch them for a little bit. <laughs> But you free them basically. What's the point of ensnare if they immediately free them again? Ah, okay, of course. Obviously. Oh, oh, sorry. This one's more punching. Well, you know, you, you ensnare them, so basically you freeze them in the spot, right? So why can't I not just sit there and punch for a bit? <laughs> okay, we found the mill. Whoa, the old mill discovered. Look at this. What a view. Gorgeous. Gotcha. <gasps> Here's some weird noises. I don't know if it's something in the wind or somebody is like humming weirdly. Could be both. Bonk. Looks derelict. Is he really in sight? Beware. Wards. If we want to stop for a wee minute, this place will do. Always trying to unlock the fast travel points. The middle's house. of these now. Maybe I can... Yay! And now I can spend something in here. Increases the damage of manifestations by 15%. This effect can be accumulated. Rippling outbursts. Outburst area of effect is increased by 30%. Again? <laughs> Crushing leap. Leap triggers an area of effect dealing spectral damage. That'd be good. Mutilation. Spirit points cost of manifestations is reduced by 30, but dam... <laughs> I read the but. I'm like not interested anymore. Waiting stance. Damage taken is reduced by 5 for each manifestation and cooldown. On the edge. Damage dealt by Antea is increased by 30, but... Nah, you s go to hell with your butt. Damage taken is reduced by 25. Well, an enemy is affected by snare. And snare's duration is increased by 2 seconds. Spirit points gains are... Blah, blah, but... Banishing and snare. Using and snare while the banish gauge is full increases and snare damage by 1,400, but consumes all banish points. 1,400, excuse me. Hang on, which one, which, which one did I like? Switching to Ante increases the damage. Spirit points. This one I think I liked. Fallback. Pairing restores 10% health points. Ooh, sharpshooter. Defeating an enemy with a rifle increases the damage of the next rifle shot. I like this one. I don't know if I can get it though. Ah, I can. Okay, cool. Mm. Oh, 
Okay. Now, can I improve any gear? I can, this one here. Okay, what do we have? Okay, this is better than... Remarkable. Ooh, sweet. Gotcha, gotcha. And we have all the decoctions, I think, so... Let's go! Okay, how do we get inside? Maybe Something has me. Wards. Bloody wards everywhere. Okay, we shall destroy them, my love. Wasn't I always? Oh, there. Hello. Hmm. Guess we're not going that way. There should be a way up here. Who's that? Yes. Something's here. your way up. Something blocking something? Maybe I have to go from the outside, but this looks like I could lower this, but I don't know how. Must be some odd mechanism again. Oh, maybe this? Is that connected? It doesn't look like it's connected. But it is, alas. <laughs> I wasn't looking at it because it looked like it's it's not really connected and shouldn't have an impact on, on the thing. But oh well, here I am. I'm out. Wherever you are. Let me symbol research. First symbol, drawing of a witch symbol, ineffective. To be paired, perhaps, with another symbol, to double the effect. Second symbol, drawing of a demologist symbol, absolute failure. <laughs> Third symbol, drawing of an... of another... another... another. <laughs> demologist symbol works, is weakly. Fourth symbol, drawing of the first and third symbol mixed together and the symbol is circled. Try this. Hmm... An attempt to translate the lesser palingenesis ritual into common English. Looks like Lamy was trying to translate some sort of ritual. Not any ritual. The this is the lesser palingenesis. Uh, I guess no one warned Lamy that grimy reincarnation rituals were not without risk. Not the smartest guy, huh? Etienne Roulet's note. I was not mistaken about the hidden potential in this region. The veil between Aralu and our world is particularly thin and therefore conductive. Con condu is there a T missing? Is this a typo? Is it a word that I don't know? Conducive? To breaches. The mad ambition of couple Procter only served to crack this already existing fragility even further. Poor amateurs, now they are punished for eternity. However, thanks to their efforts, I will be able to gain a great deal of knowledge about Aralu and succeed where everyone else has failed. I requisitioned the help of Haskell's son, who, unlike his stupid father, has potential and therefore can be of great use to me. Together, we can achieve great things. <gasps> he manipulated the poor lamb. This lad seems dangerous. Yeah, his apprentice acts. seems to be following him down the same path. Yup. Yarp. Tools. Unfinished ghost ward. More ghost wards. Someone was being extra careful. Mm. 
Let me's note, I can wait no longer. Father may preach or loll about with his selectmen, friends in town, but words will not save these people. We have the power and the duty to act, not to cower with fear for our reputations. But Father has always feared the loss of reputation, to the point of abandoning his craft, leaving me to learn in it, it in secret. For shame, if my father will not act, then I will. He doesn't speak well of his dad. No. Did he seek power? He thought he was better. He thought he was better. That's not a particularly difficult task, in oh, fairness. Poor fox. Poor rabbit. The Book of Lesser and Major Affirmations. So, what are you Chunky hiding book. in here, evil spawn? Glancing at the original writing, Lamy's work was poor. No wonder the ritual he spawned for Caleb from those botched words of power went wrong. We need to get to the top floor. Bet we'll find something. Can I move this? Yeah. Push. Oh god. Oh dear. Oh boy. I'm not a fan of heights, guys. Really not a fan. This spooks me out a lot. Okay, wait. Can I go the other way as well? Oh, oh, oh. Okay, it's like you made your you made your decision. You have to go this Once way you've now. you've revealed the roots, I'll destroy them. Oh. Wait. Come look. Come look what? At what? Amulet of Akelari. Manifestation spirit points cost is decreased by 50, but massive butt. Keep your butt. Okay, wait, let me reload. Now let me see. We have one, two, one, two. Is it just two? I am stuck. Ugh, how I hate time stuff, man. <laughs> really, I hate it. Hit the orbs. Ah, oh, forgot again. Yeah, you're right. Still stuck? No crank. Great. Okay. It's just a lift. Why is this mechanism so complex? Hmm. More magic muckery. What exactly was he up to? And how come people are struggling to find game in this? And then he just has a, a arsenal of dead animal bodies <laughs> everywhere. <laughs> Maybe because th that's where everybody struggles to find game. Test 17. The subject immediately sensed my presence. Note, herbs have no particular effect on its senses. Failure once more, yet it seemed to be deceived for a moment. Note, could this be linked to the organic tissue I used? Need to check. Inconclusive. I may be able to fool it, but if I come nearer, it starts getting agitated. Note, test with ghost ward to increase effect. Insufficient. Correct ingredients? Could it be the symbols? Still not working as expected. I believe I am onto something. We'll finalize soon. His final notes sound optimistic. Did he succeed? The crank. Good. Windmill crank. Okay, cool. So now I put that here. And now we can use it. The lift should work now. What now? Do I go all the way down again so I can take the the lift back up? 
Or is it is the lift to just go down? It seems so, eh? Oof. Oof. No, what was my way down? this good for? What, why, what did I, oof. oh wait, the chest maybe less. <laughs> I'm so blind sometimes. <laughs> I think I was, I wasn't looking at it because it was concealed by the, um, the boxes that I just shot. <laughs> so I thought it's still leftover textures that are, that haven't disappeared yet. Okay, we go down, down. Have I read that? I think I read this. Bloody hell, how did I get up here? There must be a way down again. Oof. How? I don't remember how I got in here. I remember I went out of this, but how did I get in here? Through this door? Is this yeah, okay, can open it. But wait a minute, no. Can I? Oh, there. I always went to this point and it looked like, okay, I can't, I'm gonna die if I fall down. There's stairs, bloody stairs. Oh, I'm so blind. Why am I so blind today? It's even worse than usual. What's going on? Oh God, I'm, I'm sorry guys. I don't know what's happening with my eyes. Now, where's the cranky thing that I need to use to get further down? Ah, here. What? Don't tell me I have to run all the way back up to shoot some shit. The heck? The lift should be working now. Yeah, my ass. Take the lift. I would love to! Lift ain't working! <laughs> What's wrong with the lift? What am I missing now? Come on. Yep, yep, yep. But it would be cool that There's if no if you could still get it from down there, you know. Not just we're going on the ground. We'll be careful. We don't know what Lamy was up to. And the signs are not encouraging. I I think if you know, I could get to like oh. it underground. The darkness, the gloom, the cool air. Really? No, not really. Not at all. More corrupted ivy waiting to be plucked out. Mm hmm. Hell's bombs. Another sorrow used as a guardian. I just see this one. I don't see another one. I don't know where to shoot it. That's it, maybe it's just two, but I doubt it. Did I ever mention how good? 
good we are together. <laughs> yeah. It's always good to hear. Crisp moss. Yeah, it just, it's very crunchy and crisp. Okay, explore the hidden cave. It's not that hidden. <laughs> this way now? Another elevator. Oh, deeper down we go. I hope this goes down as fast as it came up. Nope, of course not. <laughs> Grab this and this and... Um what now? Do you think we're gonna fight a big nasty monster again? I'd like I really like the big boss fights. Oh yes! Sorrow. Hmm. Trying to figure out how this works. It's coming for you! Yeah, I can tell. The directions confuse me a bit. Like, what does that mean? Ah, I have to destroy the... Oh, hello. Heal real quick, heal real quick. That's not doing me much. Have some of this. Ah, uh, you'll be free soon enough, you bastard. We have more. Ooh. Yeah. Ooh, oh, cool. Yeah. You can do jumping attacks like that. Nice. Oh, 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 oh. Incoming. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, my god. 69 damage. Nice. Oh, not Standing the chunky by. guy. That was a waste, that was a waste. That was a waste. Oh lord! Come here, you alpha tormented malaka. <laughs> the voice is ah. I I I I Here you alpha. Bonk, bonk, bonk. Okay. No, there's just a small one left. Okay. And apparently there's another one up there. Ah! Oh bloody Ooh. hell! <laughs> Leave me be. Lots of things freed at last. I'm trying. What? Chunky guy and the blue one? Ugh. Oh no, it's no good. Ooh, my lucka. Now, can I hurt you? Oh, there he is! It's coming for you! No way. Can I just shoot you? There you go. Bam! When all this is over, I might retire. <laughs> You'd miss it. You know you would. Red, come see this. Come see what? Dead animals, again. Different symbols and magic. Seems they were used as bait. 
Is this how we got through the sorrow's vigilance? Maybe. to go up Sectus ritual note success did not last more than a few minutes second try success the chicken lasted much longer than the pig was it because of the small size and requires less essence cow fail the carcass was too massive it seemed the ritual didn't even work at all Ah, now here, okay. So, here we are. I suppose now, we step into the void. <sighs> suppose we do. Oh. Form ritual. Uh, void traveling, this one. Which finder's quest complete? Ooh. The ink well has started. Oh, not like this. This tipping over and falling through it, and then dark rituals, oh. void breach, general weirdness. Let me can't be far. Okay. Ghost wards cannot manifest. In here, fucking Lemmy, man. <laughs> No, she can. Okay, cool. Take care. It's awfully calm. Why is it awfully calm? Very peaceful. Huh? It's a bit weird having like very human objects like linen and Ghost rope wards. and stuff. I cannot manifest. Is there multiple of them? No, just this one. Okay, cool. Find Lamentation Haskell. Oh, hello. Spectres. They haven't noticed us. Stay low. <laughs> Too late. Oh, wait. That was the wrong person. Hang on, hang on. Nope, no punch. Can I join in too? You, you, you were doing it. <laughs> what else do you want me to do? We're like, uh Lemme! Lemme, where are you? Came from there, right? Or did I? No, I come from here. So we hop over here now. Uh-oh. I had a big grunty, growly... Oh, there he is. And oh, he's a he's a strongy one. Yeah. Yeah. Throw in tantrum, are we? Not now. Why not? All right then. Thank you. I saw that a bit too late, didn't I? I don't know if I'm supposed to do anything with this. Oh, hi. Quicken yourself. Go to hell. Maybe this way? Up here? I think there already are in hell. Eh. 
guess that's a matter of definition, isn't it? Did I go back? I'm so confused with this place. <laughs> a cage? Okay. Freaking hell! <laughs> what am I doing? Where am I going? What the? Down here? No, this is where I just climbed up, right? Ugh. Do I just have to kill these? Maybe they just keep spawning because I am constantly going out and back into the area. I'm s I'm confused. I think I came from here when I entered this area. From there. So... What is the way forward now? Hmm. It's only actually this one. But then there's two. Two ways up there. Let's try this one. Uh-huh, there's shiny stuff, so I haven't been here yet. Creepy hideout. The governor spawn likes a bit of drama. <laughs> drama queen. Okay, before we interact with the things that progress, uh, let me just... This one's different. Looks like it died diseased. The plague that they struggle with? A hand-drawn map of the Harrows with the initials ER. Two places have been circled, the abandoned mill and God's Acre Cemetery. The veil between the Aralu and the Incarnate seems particularly thin in these two areas. A breach? Obscure demon demonology writings. Ghostly apparitions can be controlled, or at least shepherd. shepherded. Shepherded? With a variety of known rituals. These must be performed with great care, lest control be ceded to potentially catast cat catastrophic effect. An ineligible equation. If the words of power differ from 1.0. 0.1 in intensity and appropriate protections are not carefully used, the ghost will appear, but will not bend to the demonologist's will. This is to be avoided, on risk of widespread injures, injuries, death, or worse. This is some dark, sideways magic. It's forbidden. I've read it. <laughs> Sometimes I worry about you. What is this shit? Ugh. Yikes! Ugh. What is this thing? <laughs> Banish a rule number four. If it oozes, don't touch it. Another botched experiment? Is a, a good rule. It may be native to the void. <laughs> oh, look here. Who comes back? <sighs> so, you can see me. Aren't you full of surprises, young Master Husker? You may talk. A Banisher ghost. Amazing. How on God's earth did you find me? Never mind that. Thank the Lord you did. Thought I was going to grow old in here. You're stuck in here? Hiding in the void? Were you stuck here? Were you stuck in here? In the Aralu? Originally I was searching for the source of the poisoning. I may have overestimated my talents. Still, an amazing place to be stuck in, no? No. Tell me, how did you get Not past really? the Guardian beneath the mill? Did you use a decoy? We fought it. Don't change the subject. You fought it? Of course you did! A good thing too. I was starting to think it was wise to me tricks. Oh, but I have so many questions. This isn't a social call, kid. And we're the ones with the questions. Oh. Oh. Of course. We must talk of Caleb Watson. 
Why in the hell would you give him a resurrection ritual? Ruth's death hit poor Caleb hard. He was alone, and so I would often stop by his workshop. We talked. He took a keen interest in my studies and was a good listener. When he learned that she could possibly return, he had one question. How? A pretty tale indeed. You saw his grief as an opportunity. You know, I think he seems very nice and sweet, but um, I think his interest and lust and hunger for knowledge and his carelessness and about all of this makes him very dangerous in that matter. Because he, he's just like handing out ritual stuff and he could cause a lot of damage with this. You saw his grief as an opportunity to test the effects of the lesser palingenesis. Oh, you know the ritual too? Amazing, isn't it? I've studied it. The actual ritual. Not the mangled version you gave Caleb. Yes, and I'm sorry. I found it in a copy of De Occulti Philosophia by Cornelius Agrippa von Nettesheim. A remarkable book. I've met my fair share of illustrious occultists, and none owned an authentic Agrippa. Much is lost in translation or altered in the printing. I doubt your copy is an exception. Of course! The power is in the words, and mine were wrong, so the power went awry. How very fascinating! <gasps> you must mend your ways, your studies put you in danger. Mend your ways means he needs to stop, right? Naive, to say the least. Yeah, he's very naive. You mistake foolishness for audacity. You must mend your ways. Surely the acquisition of knowledge cannot be a sin. Will you still say that when Pennington accuses you of witchcraft? You must remember Deborah. Miss Comenius. Yes, of course, I remember. Your father tasked us with an investigation. One way or the other, we must return with the mystery solved. Ah. I think I understand what you're saying. I might be in a tiny little bit of, uh, danger. Yeah. Who are you really? You see ghosts. You stroll the void as if it were your garden. You possess and share forbidden rituals. Who are you really? I'm Lammy Haskell, and I am a man of many sciences. I am in fact a true pursuer. That raises more questions than it answers. What are the pillars of the universe? Which principles underpin existence? As occultists, do we change the world or scratch upon its surface? Each discipline I embrace peels back a new layer of reality. I'm yet at the beginning and see where I already stand. Amazing, no? We already know who taught him. Are you a demonologist like your father? More or less. Less, more so. My father sees occultism through the eyeglass of his faith, but I know better. So, more so? If you don't share your father's faith, what do you believe? Science. I believe in the afterlife. The proof is about us. And if the void embodies eternal despair, there must too be a place of hope. But where, I ask myself, where? Your father is on a witch hunt. Your life is on the line. We find you up to your neck in the blackest magic, speechifying about your transcendent journey. Your life is on the line, Lamy. We must counter the devil with knowledge of his tricks. That, my father always said, is the purest of God's work. Uh, I can imagine your father saying that. When I was ten, he gave me my initiation. Demonology, sir, as he would say. He saw me as his heir. Then, of a sudden, the books were forbidden. So I stole them. The very same books he'd forced upon me as a boy. I understand them where he does not. I did no wrong. Apart from a little theft.
You've studied demonology. Did you do it alone? When my father forbade me to continue, I confess I disobeyed him in secret. Those big books were very boring until they were forbidden. Suddenly I could not get enough of their secret knowledge. Funny, eh? More recently, a good friend of my father showed me that I had only been scratching at the surface. Who was that friend? He taught you in secret? It was Etienne, wasn't it? He taught you in secret? On his visits, I would assist him with the research for the writing of his books. When the curse fell, he fled with thick-skinned Newsmith and left all his work behind. I hope he made it. I'd surely like to one day show him the advances I've made upon his work. If this is Harry Potter, we're st he's stuck with <laughs> Slytherin. You guys, this cannot be Harry Potter. This guy is willing to learn and do studies. The only thing Harry had in his mind was... Quidditch and Cho Chang. <laughs> and later Ginny. From the looks of this place, you're knee-deep in research. What are you doing here, exactly? Searching for the origin of the Harrow's Plague, of course. And I have a theory on the subject. Of course you do. Go on, then. Now, at first, I believed the water poisoned, but my father sealed the well, and yet folk remained sick. They looked for witchcraft, a foolish, uneducated suspicion, yes, but with some truth concealed behind it. You see, the Aralu taints New Eden. Its influence leeches into the Harrows. The evidence is everywhere. Everywhere. Can you prove that? Where is your evidence? In New Eden, the threshold between our plane and this is thin. Even I, a novice, may reach the frontier and then go beyond. I also believe it happened before. Some years ago, New Eden was hit by another epidemic. Yes. We learned of it in Fort Jericho. I believe that first epidemic was caused by the porosity of the frontier between New Eden and the Aralu. Although, where theirs was an affliction of burning flesh, ours is a corruption of mind and spirit. And I believe I have found its source. There is a substance, a strange ooze. You may have noticed it. This, I believe, is the true source of the Harrow's poison. It carries a particular stink, on the scent of which I experience first confusion, then a loss of control over my limbs. What do you expect to find at the source of the ooze? More ooze. To find a cure. The ooze seeps into our world, sickening us. I may be able to stop it. Unfortunately, I cannot reach the source. The Aralu is a formidable place. Tricky. A maze constantly evolving, changing, reshaping itself. The Isthmus, for example. What? I found an oozing crack in the ground. The terrain then remade itself, and I can get to it no longer. Perhaps we might be able to find a way through and take a look at that source. Would you? That would be splendid. Would you mind taking notes? Oh man, I thought I could ask more questions. Oh well, goodbye. <laughs> Let's go take a closer look at that ooze then. And with that sorrow gone, I can leave. Do be careful. My home is your home. If you need anything, help yourself. The Aralu is not your home, Lamy. But thank you. Yeah. Get the heck out of here, kid. <laughs> uh, pardon my morbid enthusiasm, Mr. Stuarte, but could I ask you a few questions? What do you wish to know? Do you still need to eat? Do you feel hunger? Sorry, it's well, just... You're the first ghost I've met. Uh, in person, as it were. I don't eat. Not in the way you do. I feel hunger. Again, not in the way you do. Fascinating. And can you touch things, smell them? Are colors the same as you remember them? My senses are different. It's difficult to describe how. I can see, sometimes touch. I cannot smell. Red tells me this is a blessing. How do you manifest in this plane? Do you feel bound or are you here by choice? 
It feels as if I were clinging to a rope high above the abyss. Even if I wished to let go, I could not bring myself to do it. I see. What about your banisher skills? Can you use them? Do the accoutrements of your craft still He's very work? curious indeed. As a ghost, do they not harm you? The marks on my hands and the rings on my fingers aren't actually there. They have no more effect on me than a memory. Can you talk to any ghost you wish? No. I sense traces of their presence. To talk to them, I must still do the work. And yet here I am, talking to you. How marvelous. The dead are rarely as articulate, nor are they accommodating. In fact, they're often quite rude. We should probably get going. Some other time, then. Well, we've merely scratched at the surface Kids, of the stop great it. mysteries. Let my lady alone. Look around us. We stand here beyond the ultimate frontier. S sorry. <laughs> I mean to say, yes, Mistress Duarte. Quick, before he opens his mouth again. <laughs> He's like, pop, 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 We should get going. Yeah. Bye, kid. So, the pious governor's unassuming son is our evil Harrow's witch. I sensed it. He's dangerous. He used to be earnest. I think he's dangerous, actually, because he's so naive. The more powerful the loose cannon, the more dangerous it is. He, he knows a great deal, and he's very careless about it and naive, which makes him incredibly dangerous. He might not have bad intentions, but he might... I don't know that I buy Lamy's hair of the dog theory, hmm. but I feel strange, and I suspect the ooze. There's only one way to find out. Ew. Ew, oh, I'm running through the ooze. God. Ew, yuck. Yuck indeed. Here we better help you. Can she just run through? Ah, okay, that's cool. <laughs> Well, that was not pleasant. Nope. Well, not pleasant at all. Nope. Reach the souls of the ooze. Let's get to the ooze right now. <gasps> now we just go and find a massive pimple. <laughs> I can't, Rory. Rory? I'm on the right track. I'm a bit confused. Uh, uh, uh. Could you make up your mind, Marka? Ah, that's what I was trying to do the entire ghost time. Ghost wards. I cannot manifest. Oh, bloody ghost wards. Fucking Lemmy putting ghost wards everywhere. It's almost annoying as the bloody Bibles. Where? Where are they? Ha! I'm with you once more. Good. Not a fan of ghost wards. Huh? They're getting annoying. Damn ghost wards. <laughs> no. Aha, uh -huh, I need to go up there so I can do the the, the the jumpy jumps, right? Right, up there. Zoom, 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 zoom. Here. And now I can do the... There. Whee! Oh, hi. Tantrum there. Woo. Oh, wow, I got him <laughs> right in the perfect moment. Ethereal bone fragment. Ooh, fancy. It oozes through the breach, suppurates like a festering wound. How delightful. 
Yikes. And it looks like it's breathing at times. Let's see what lies on the other side. Oh, we flopping over again? Boy traveling. Wee. Now it comes my favorite tip over in like... Boop. <laughs> I really like this. Where are we now? Underground, Hello. looks like. Wonderful. Ink well discovered. Ooh. You never die, Liz. Okay. Sounds promising. The ooze affects the incarnate, too. Yikes. Who goes there? <gasps> oh, at first, I at first I thought this guy had like had something stuck in his know. head. But I don't think we're alone. But it was just a head, a head on his head. Where do you go? What might you be then? Oh shite. Did you did you just say shite? You Yeah. I was surprised too about the same thing. Like she I never heard her say that before. Wait, there's Okay. Everywhere the entity goes or the the, the copy and mirror of it. I thought it'd be. Is that a house from the Harrows? We may be below the well. No wonder they all got sick. Is that the burned house. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I really enjoy this game. Oh, I love these things. There's a there's a movie. Whenever I see stuff like this, I always think of it. It's called Ferngully. They were dancing on these little puddles. Burnt Gully is cool. Maybe it's not the burnt house. Collapsed house discovered. As above, so below. I feel a draft. From the invisible. What does this say? And the woman, being astonished thereat, confessed those things to be true, and that she and other persons named in this pre preternatural discourse had had familiarity with the devil. Being asked whether she had made an express covenant with him, she answered she had not, only as she promised to go with him when he called, which accordingly she had sundry times done. Sundry times? Wait, can I... Can I camp here? What? I feel something close. Yeah, yeah. No. Was it this? <laughs> Shiny loot. Oh. We're within gun range, Ray. Small battlefield, no, no leggy. My god, you're brutal, sir. There you go. Now 
going, what did I do this for? <laughs> Just to get my booty kick? Oh, this is too far, is it? Oh, it's not, actually. Okay. So <laughs> rude. I was looting, exactly. The audacity. How do I get up there? Something's here. Hidden. Please, no Bible. Gibbs Farm account books. Wall repair, ties, ale and bread, candles, carpenter, wood, sundries. Revenue, 80 pieces of eight, corn, horse meat. This is interesting. Tires, tags, uh, corn, uh, okay. Uh, usually the last one is interesting, right? Or is it? Is it at all interesting? I don't know. This house belonged to a certain Antipas and Clemency Gibbs. Their land was barren. They were struggling for money. Look up. The ooze... Uh, oozed through the very stone. Ugh. Gibbs, I thank you for your note. God himself knows times are hard. That you could not honor our last order of grain was understandable. We find ourselves in a similar position and, upon the deaths of our last cattle, must cancel our next order. Please find and close the balance of our account, which we shall consider closed, at least until better times are come again. God save us all from this curse. Richard Mellons. And of all of them, just this one house fell down. Maybe it was personal. Could this house have been targeted by the ooze? Obviously. Look around you. Obviously. The dowser. <laughs> Mr. and Mrs. Gibbs, have you read my paper? Oh, Deborah. I read it, I. And then I washed my hands and prayed for grace. You claim to prove that there is no curse. Well... A witch would say that, wouldn't she? Wherever people gather to live, disease takes hold, and I believe... What are you doing? Your evil lies shall be destroyed. We know who you are, and you shall be judged. Which? That was Deborah. She Again. built a case for her rationality, and then tore it apart. Double kill. Did we miss a few? No. Oh, maybe yes. <laughs> maybe we did. Hard to say. <laughs> Sorry. Oh. Hang on a minute. you out of your meat suit or you punch me but I banish you banish your funeral <laughs> yes literally explore the cave I don't know if I can go up here from here from here 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 can I climb on the shelf no nope. all right it was worth a shot oh I can go up here was that here before hi Hello, chest. I want to loot you. Mm, okay, that's a small bed. Now what? Investigate the house. We're not done with the house yet. Good. Gotcha. I already checked this out, right? What else am I missing? I already read this. Amity Gibbs, Providence Town, to Antipas and Clemency Gibbs, the Harrows, New Eden. Dearest parents, Reuben and I are settled here in Providence. Our home is quaint and quite lovely. You would like it, I think, though perhaps you would argue against the colors of the drapes. We attend the meeting house with rigor. The sermon Sunday last was particularly beautiful, and I'm certain you would have enjoyed it. Man of 
piety there are yet in New England. In your last letter, you mentioned that the farm has seen some trouble. If God tests you, I am full sure that you will pass his examination. However, should you need it, Reuben will be delighted to make you a loan. We may also consider a visit should you agree to certain stipulations on your behavior and manner of speaking, particularly to Reuben, who deserves neither wheedling nor snide remarks. Your daughter, Emily. This was probably not what I was supposed to investigate, I guess. So what am I missing? Can I- oh! Mrs. Gibbs, I presume. What? Where? Just a plant in the middle of nowhere. Makes sense. Vidya game logic, vidya game logic. Another shadow. What do they want? I see you. Red, something is keeping me from manifesting. In here? Oh, shite. <laughs> shite. Um, g in general, or do I have to find ghosts? Take thing? care. Ghost the place is warded. Yeah, I figured as much. I see a ghost ward. No! No, no, Watch out. no, no, no! Spectre possession. Let me, let me, let me. <laughs> Fucking hell. Oh crap, oh crap, oh crap. Okay, this is dangerous. Ooh. Oh no. Nasty buggers. Out of stamina? Oh, that was a waste. <laughs> that was a waste. That's a waste. I could not shoot this before. That was rubbish. Here I am. Go to Ward. Think you can fend for yourself? No. I don't want to come back. I want to use your quick powers. I can't worry. Yeah, but then stop giving me the little thing that I that I should be doing something here. Better. Ha. Huh? You're welcome. Now let's inspect the body. The body. The body. The body. Where's the body? I think it's over there, but I don't know how to reach it. <laughs> oh, wait. <laughs> I believe we need a bus here if I blast a way through. Oh. Come here. Expect no less from you, Mrs. Gibbs. Ow. Chunky guy, no. Come on, big boy. Belly shot. 
I wonder why sometimes the health bar turns golden. Like that. Or pulsating golden orange. I don't know if that was ever explained and I missed it or so. What is your weak point, though? Sorry, the big belly? And punched out of the existence again. I make no damage to him right now. Um. Oh, 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 rolling, rolling, rolling. Clemency gives diary. Haskell and his town flock are here, fled from their homes. We have room for all in the Harrows. There is a mold on the wall near the front door. I shall scrape it off. The mold has turned sickly black and oozes between the boards. The crops such as they were have failed. The governor and his band, band of weak-hearted souls have brought the curse with them. May the Lord deliver us. The black stuff is everywhere. Folk sicken, hard of breathing and bleeding from every orifice you'd care to mention and some you would not the devil spits and we are flooded with it i'm minded of seven years ago when plague last hit i pray to god to grant me clemency gibbs and my loyal and moderately capable husband antipas the wisdom to once again out the witch god will not help us because our governor uses magic his boy what's his name the idiot he put a pagan totem by the house I tore it down. Antipas said he saw Haskell throw something into the well, and then the earth shook. What are the Haskells up to? Clemency Gibbs blamed the epidemic on a witch. Come from New Eden time with the governor. That's not what Deborah was saying. Well, the Gibbs are not at home to rational explanations. I have the feeling that the curse just follows those leaders like Haskell and Pennington and I kind of regret that I didn't sacrifice Pennington at this point because maybe the curse would be lifted if I could do that. If I would have just killed them. See anything? Either the water table is full of ooze, or there's another source. Let's search upstream. Can I? No. Oh, this way? Can I go this way? Ew. Can I? I'm confused. Upstream, so I need to go back, or this way, it says. But I cannot go this way, or can I destroy it? Ah, you can destroy these, okay. It looked ominous, but I wasn't sure. I tried dodging into it, it didn't work. The pit. That's Deborah again. stuff it up! Oh crap. It's on you. Yeah. there. Oh, loose of little buggers. Ugh. Oh, hi and bye. Can I walk over this as well? Okay. This is how I came. 
Don't step in that. I mean it. Find a way around that. Those echoes are here. The shadows speaking. They always appear near the ooze. Yeah. So are the whispers. But which came first? Can I not just zoom over there? Over here. Look. Where? What? I saw something that I got. Oh, I had to go up there so I could shoot it? Because he's in the way, is he not? He's kind of blocking it. And I can't shoot it. Find the source of the ooze. There? <laughs> Get it. Destroy those ghost wards if you uh, want to. Ghost me back. wards. There's ghost wards again. Uh, I just actually just wanted to play to the next save point and or maybe finish this area, but this area is way way bigger than I expected. Actually thought I'm almost out of here again. I don't know where the ghost wards are. Wards. I'm going to need a hand here. Ah, there's one. Okay, and now I can blow this up. Still impressive. Always impressive. Looting all the stuff on the way. Woo. Am I done with this? Sometimes I can't tell, is this the way towards progress or not? <laughs> Maybe I had to go up here so I get an angle so I can shoot the things. Now, now I could shoot this, right? Before the, the thingies were in the way. Get out of this oozy stuff. Oh, wait, what? Wait a minute. Can she not jump over this? Oh, okay. The whispers say the same things over and over. What kind of entity would be so obsessed? I don't know. I'm drawing a blank. Hmm. <laughs> trying to make sense of what they're saying but I all I hear is godly blah blah holy god our lord blah 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 <laughs> don't let that specter get to the cold no you meat take on a for ghost. you no you play bastard die good pulverized Watch out! No. Back to position. No. You son of a gun! Oh man, I hate. It's so hard to interrupt them sometimes. You feel like yeah, this should totally interrupt them, and they're like, no, too late. Yeah, whatever. Not carefully drinkable. <laughs> Famous last words. Why hasn't the poison spread to the groundwater? Perhaps it shifts and shapes, like the void. Well, at the very least, it shifts. Looks like the ooze comes from a distinct source. Find the source of the ooze still. I just sorry, but this whole country is rotten to the core. And there you're just now reaching this conclusion. <laughs> if I wanted your opinion, I'd give it to you. 
Perhaps if you gave me the space to have one, then we'd both be better off. Oh, trouble in paradise. Someone came through here, someone real, not just a shadow. Maybe it's corrupting the both of them at this point. Whoever it was, it looks like the ooze got them. What do you think, Antea? You wanted the space to have your own opinion. I'm giving it to you. Ay, ay, ay. Ugh, the sound. Can I? No. Cannot turn into Antea right now. Investigate the area. What else do you want me to do? It says that I need to go this way. Can't turn into her. Is there something over there? Ah, oh, yeah, there's something blinking over there. Sorry, I didn't see that. This must be Antipas Gibbs. Hell of a fall to live through. Now join in any time, Antea. What do you think I'm doing? What is going on between the two? <laughs> it's definitely corrupting them or something. There you go. Now... Did I miss another thing? Can I jump over anywhere? I mean... No. I just have to go back the way that I came? Just suddenly in order each other, yeah. <laughs> I'm just waiting for him to be like, I can't wait until you're really gone. <laughs> it's really pissed. <laughs> Something's nearby. Where is it? Oh I couldn't I couldn't turn into her at this point. That's why I missed it. Oh, it's ahead. This is God's land. How could we let a witch come to our community? Instructing our children, no less. Tis no surprise. New Eden brims over with backsliders. The governor, chief amongst them. Aye. Many had to sicken and die for him to act. But the deed is not yet done. We must fight the Lord's good fight and cast the devil out for good. Many want to try the witch, aye. And many want to see her dead. Okay, that, that looks cool. Oh no, you're, you're one of the blue ones, right? Just covered in ooze. This isn't over yet. Obviously. Oh, I can shoot them. Sweet. Dang it. Oh, I don't like when they run on all fours like that. No bueno. This isn't over yet. Mm -hmm. Antipas! No, Antipas, don't do it! He's a stronky guy. Uh, bang! I have another in sight. Sorry, I have to beat up this fella first. You got this, man. I don't want to go into the Uzi part. <laughs> oh, shade, I missed. Show them why they should fear banishers. Yeah. But I wanted to hug them, Antea. I just want. Yeah, damn it. Yeah. Hang on. Taking the hits like a champ. <laughs> Come on. No. No, 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 no. You're done. Come on, do it. Do it. Do it. Oh, shit. <laughs> do it again. 
There you go. There's a tough one. You I'm in the ooze. I'm in the ooze. Oh, no. Those things came from Level the ooze. Up. Yay. They're like those oriental shapeshifters we fought in Bremen. Or back Bremen. in Equify. German. This is something else. The ooze reacted to our presence. The Gibbs were so angry. Pure, entitled bigotry. Maybe they were affected by the ooze. I mean, we've been snapping at each other since we got here. Yeah. Something's toying with us. I think they made the ooze. I don't think the ooze made them. We can't leave yet. I don't intend. I don't want to leave, I want to save. <laughs> My god. <laughs> okay. This is it. This is the source. How do we get to it? Did it have to see this? Aha. Uh -huh. If you need a rest, this place is as good as any. Groundwater source, okay. Okay, then maybe I'm gonna do that one real quick as well. I have two of these. Can I level anything right now? Not really, can I? No. Shucks. Could. What is this? Rifle hits. Ref oh, yeah, this was crap. What's this? Vanish point gains are increased, but less. I don't really need the charges right now that much, so let's let's just put it in there. Okay. Uh, I need. Oh yeah, now I have three out of three. Okay. I. Okay, one more fight, guys, but then I really have to call it. <laughs> Let's go. Let's kill that bloody source. Source. Sauce. <laughs> Saucy source. Wait, how do I get out of here? This way. Something tells me this is the condemned well. Do you think you could get that bucket down? Bucket? Bucket. The bucket is tainted. Bucket? What bucket? What the? What bucket? Oh, this bucket. <laughs> okay, hang on, hang on a second, ma'am. There it goes. A strong memory clings to this place. An echo from the past drifts by. The bucket? The devil still breathes through her mouth. We are cursed, and you are stalling. Clemency, Antipas, please. The woman has been jailed. As per custom, she will face trial, and justice will be brought to this community. Coming from a magic user himself. But can you or your demonologist discernment really be trusted? How dare you insinuate such blasphemy? I'm a man of faith. His son? Do what God commands of you. Governor, we ask for safety. If we do not get it, there will be consequences. A set of Urim and Thummim, tools of divination and cleromancy, thought to reveal the will of God. The governor used Urim and Thummim, and that made his flock suspicious. Divination stones. He must have thrown them down the well when he sealed it. Why now? He's afraid he was hiding evidence. Hiding the evidence, perhaps, of his role in the witch trial. They connected him to the demonology he used to reinforce his authority. That echo proves that things were getting out of hand. For his son's safety and his own, Haskell must have feared the suspicious mob. Alright, this looks like boss battle arena. Let's go in! Shush! 
Oh, this can't be good. Nope. You, 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 you. He just wants his head back. <laughs> the music's epic. <gasps> it's him. Oh, he's made of jelly. Speak, so you listen. Impudence, provocation, read the charges. Let ruin the prey. You have all of your hands and witness in your heart. Guilty. Swords of vanquish evil. You conspired with witches. Swan to banish all ghosts. Instead, you embrace one. The charges. Cowardice, oath-breaking, deception. The verdict. Guilty. The sentence. Pain hereafter. Cowardice is against the law? Since when? Think I'm no witch hunter, I only seek the truth. I only seek the truth. Come close to me, come close to me. I want to use my outburst power. I don't want to go in there, you know? Maybe I have to, I don't know. Oh god, these remind me of things from Elden Ring and oh dear. Is that me? Touch it, thank. Oh crap. Okay, so he has to fight himself. Bloody hell, that stinks. Yeah, and it stinks probably as well. Red shadow. Ew, no, 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 no. Crap, I missed. The shadow's got its strength back. Don't let the ooze get back to its shadow. Okay. Oh, uh, what? Use it to me. Use the power. There you go. I don't want to face myself. Yeah, yeah, I know. But I need to kill the ooze thingy. To me. Oh, this is annoying. Like, they, they're like, they're confusing me with the look to me, but then they're like, I have to face you myself. Now make up your mind, you two. Ah! Him. 
That's oh, enough. God. No more drinks. Yeah, great. And everything that is in the earth oh. shall. Can I skip this now? I only seek the truth. So how many of these do I have to kill? Stop that. <laughs> what the hell just came out of that shadow? It's working. Keep at it. I'm just trying to tank for this fight right now. I don't know what to do against that attack. Heal, heal. Come on, shoot already. Help! Uh. <laughs> Sticky shite. One, one more, one more, one more, one more. Getting rid of that ooze should weaken the shadows. Now what? What do I do? What do I do? What do I do? What can I do? I clicked it! I clicked it! I can't click it! There you go. <laughs> To do this three times. wanted this. I hate the very thing I've become. This is going to vex me. Shoot it, shoot it, shoot it! This just won't do. Let me! Now you. Can we now fight together? Magic is not evil, and Taya died to help you. Magic is not evil. We use rituals to help the living. Not cast them. Magic is only a tool. You're on your own, right? Oh god, this is gonna end badly. Oh god, they're so tanky. I need to be the 
the one to face it. You won't do that again. Shit. Her name is Deborah. Oh shit. Come on, come on, come on. And everything that is in the earth shall live. One bloody hit, man. <laughs> All right, guys, I think I'm going to do this tomorrow. I thought this is going to be as easy as all the other fights, um, but they're really nasty. They do a lot of damage and they zoom forward and they have aerial uh, like area of effects and all that kind of stuff. Like there's a lot, a lot going on there in this fight. So we'll continue with this tomorrow and hopefully beat their asses. <laughs>